It may not look like it today, but it is the season for recreational activities in the Laurel Highlands. And two local towns may be getting a big boost in tourism and economic development with its local trails. Melanie Gillespie here tonight with more on that and what it means for the area. Mel? Barney, this program helps develop the growing number of trails around the region through promotion and marketing. Evansburg and Salzburg are two future trail towns hoping to see a boost in business. Sometimes you don't know what's in your backyard till somebody else shows you. The backyard of the Laurel Highlands is the playground for western Pennsylvania. Some of the most traveled is the Great Allegheny Passage and Trans Allegheny Trail. The trail brings a new market, uh, you know, a new new people to your business and could help make, you know, make a few extra dollars. That's why the Progress Fund runs Trail Town program and it's making a stop right here in our region. And we saw Salzburg and Evansburg, you know, they're not fully connected right now, but they've got a lot of trails right in their backyard. It's a great opportunity for business development here and for our existing businesses here to take advantage of some of the programs that they offer. Trail Town program helps develop tourism and economic impact trail by trail. You want to come to town, you want to feel welcome, you want to have a place to eat, place to rest. So we want to add those services and really add to the tourism factor. We have a great downtown community. We have um, a lot of um, areas to expand here. We've got some old historic buildings that would we would love to see new businesses come into. Giving local business a boost by becoming a destination through recreation. Um, we'd love to see the program expand here and it's it's another chance for us to promote Evansburg and promote our community. It's all about the experience from being on the trail, coming into town, spending the night, you know, making a, you know, a staycation or a vacation out of recreation. Now, there's still a few more steps that need to be taken. Next month, local business leaders will go through an assessment with the program to learn more about becoming a trail town. Reporting live, Melanie Gillespie, 6 News.